If your upper thread tension is not working correctly, you can have all sorts of problems with quality of stitching and in, a, in severe cases, your thread, if it's completely untensioned, will nest underneath the needle plate, causing you problems. So, quick way to test is to thread your machine in the normal way with the presser foot in the up position, which opens the tension disc and allows the thread to go in there. And whichever way your machine is threaded, just thread it up. This is a, a V-series brother machine, so it's an automatic threader. And if you take your thread from the back of the needle with the foot in the up position, you should find that your thread pulls through easily. And then when you lower your presser foot, it should bend the needle because the tension of the thread is tight. Okay, that's working correctly. If that's not right, if you're getting that when your presser foot's down, then you probably have contamination up in here, which we need to clear out. Okay, we need to be able to get to the tension discs, which are in here. There'll be a cover on your machine, similar to this, um, quite possibly with a screw cap covering the screw, which holds it in place. Uh, some of the machines, you go in from the front here. This one, you just undo this screw, do this with the machine switched off, and remove that screw. And what I suggest you do before you take this off is take a photograph of it so that you can see just exactly how it sits when you come to put it back because it needs to sit perfectly in place as it is there. It is possible to put it on and fasten it down in the wrong position. You don't want to do that. So basically you take this cover off. Some of them can be a little bit fiddly, but just be gentle with the machine. There are little clips on some of these. So just gently take this cover off, which exposes then the thread tension unit, which is here. So the problem area will be that there is some contamination of some description, probably thread trapped between those tension discs. If they're closed because your foot uh, was down in the in the down position, then you can just you can just open your tension disc like so. Okay, make sure the machine switched off, and then check in here thoroughly for any sort of contamination that may have got left in there from either thread or something that's been dragged in there, like a little bit of sticky contamination. Clean off these plates. Get your whatever it is that you're going to clean this with. I've got some fine tweezers here. But basically just clean off the plates and clean in between there as well. Check between these two plates here that you've got no contamination in there. If you can, give it a bit of a dust out, a blowout, um, a vacuum cleaner, anything on there that will take out any debris that's in that section. If that's nice and clean, then you shouldn't have any issues with your thread being incorrectly tensioned from the top. To replace this, just I line up this little slot here with this, this metal here and just pop that in place, pop your screw back in, pop the cover back on top. 